Today we're measuring methane emissions from cattle. This is the first using this system, so we've been measuring methane emissions from sheep for a long time using this particular system. When we measure gases from animals, we use a respiratory chamber which captures all of the gas for a 48 hour period. For breeding, we don't need 48 hours of measures, we just need a short measure. So what we've done is make a simple chamber that basically catches all the gas that's emitted from an animal for just one hour, and we monitor that, we measure that, and then we use that to, to rank animals. It's been successfully done with, with tens of thousands of sheep. The difference between a sheep chamber and a cattle chamber obviously firstly is size. We want the cow to feel nice and safe and we want it to be reasonably narrow but we have to get the volume of air that we need to measure the gas in the right way so they're quite tall. The system is built around a really calm atmosphere, everything's kept very quiet, uh, the animals are loaded very carefully and we're just trying to keep everything as quiet and as calm as possible. So there are very few tools to mitigate enteric methane emissions on farm. There are very few ways that we can control our emissions. This is giving us a tool which means that we can actually control or lower methane emissions using genetics, using breeding. So we can measure animals through these chambers, we can then get a breeding value or a worth of each animal and we can rank them. And the animals that emit less methane per kilo of, of grass eaten, those are the ones that we're looking for. Those are the ones that we want to breed for the next generation. And because it's heritable, if we choose those animals, then we will lower the methane emissions for generations to come. The chambers have been built and developed by scientists at AgriSearch, but we're really looking to support the national campaign. So we're really looking to support the, the greenhouse gas centre's national drive to measure methane across the, the national herd. So we've been working with people like LIC, CRV, Palmu, Beef and Lamb New Zealand to really make sure that we have a cohesive plan and that the national plan, we're all working together. So the advantage of having a portable chamber means that we can basically measure them anywhere. We can measure them from pasture. So we can bring them in from pasture, we can measure them and we can turn them back out onto the same pasture. So we get methane emissions on farm. And the great thing about the portable chambers is that we can move them from farm to farm. So from a biosecurity perspective, we don't need to have a lot of animals coming through a particular farm. The goals for supply and manufacture, if these chambers perform as well as we think they will, is that firstly a national rollout, so really making sure that there are centres around New Zealand where we can bring cattle to measure or we can measure them on farm, and secondly international, particularly for countries or systems that are low infrastructure or extensive grazing systems where we think there will be a real benefit.